The new Thorts and Customs ARAK Cheek Rest Kit featuring the Mission First Tactical Evolve Saddle comes pre-assembled and includes mounting hardware. Install the castle nut onto the buffer tube with the large notches facing the rear of the buffer tube. Thread the castle nut onto the buffer tube about 3 quarters of an inch. Insert the receiver end plate with the bump facing the open end of the buffer tube. Thread the assembly onto the receiver until the front edge of the tube reaches the edge of the buffer tube retainer hole. Insert the buffer retaining spring into the retainer and drop the assembly into the hole. Turn the buffer tube until the lip captures the pin. Check to be sure that the pin can move freely. Rotate the buffer tube clockwise slightly to expose the takedown pin detent hole. Insert the rear takedown pin with the slot facing the rear of the receiver. Insert the detent followed by the detent spring. Rotate the buffer tube counterclockwise until the receiver end plate is over the spring. Slide the end plate forward until the bump nests into its registration hole in the receiver, being sure not to kink the spring. Hold in place while hand tightening the castle nut. Check to make sure the takedown pin operates properly before proceeding. Using a castle nut wrench or armorer's wrench, tighten the castle nut to approximately 40 foot pounds of torque. Push the cheek rest assembly forward until it contacts the receiver. Drop the threaded sleeves into the clamping block, then drop the assembly into the gap with the narrow edge facing the receiver. Using the two provided 1 hex wrenches, thread the four button head screws into the block. Tighten until snug. Use of Loctite is not recommended. Thread the 5mm bolt into the buffer tube loosely, then slide the saddle assembly back until it stops against the bolt. Tighten the bolt to approximately 10 foot-pounds. Installation is now complete.